that will not be necessary. I assure you, we will get on quite splendidly without you. That will be all. Thank you. That is not all, Mr. Maracek. For the past month, I can't seem to do anything right. Everything's changed. What is it? Is it me? Is it you? If my work's bad now, it's been bad for 15 years. Why the hell did you wait till now to start telling me? Here, you raise your voice in this shop. <laughs> you did that on purpose, didn't you? Well, I had to stop that argument before you did something foolish, like resigning. Well, I don't know that I appreciate that. I didn't do it for you, George. I did it for me. Well, who knows, if you resign, your successor might take one look at me and, and ask himself, what is that? idiot doing in this fancy perfumery. What a slob. You're a very good clerk. I'm an idiot. But at least I'm an idiot with a job. <laughs> what a slob. Call me fool. That's all right with me. Here's my rule. Never disagree. Where's my pride? Swallowed long ago. Deep inside. Where it doesn't show. Bowing, scraping, nodding, beaming, always humble, not an ounce of self-respect. Yes, sir, yes, sir, you're so right, sir, black is white, sir, excuse me while I say you black. How do I remain so calm and cheerful? How do I retain my peace of mind? Let me just explain my rationale. It's all in your perspective. Listen. Actually, my pre- 